hello everyone welcome back again on my youtube channel if you are here you're waiting for another puzzle and i'm gonna bring on the screen right away another puzzle for today so here we have this position where black just played h3 and this pawn is just two moves away to be a queen so our king cannot really stop this pawn as uh, the white king from the starting position is not in the square this is the square and white king has to be inside the square to stop the pawn so we can't really catch the pawn by the king if we push the pawn ourselves then we're gonna have the queen and the queen so in this position the engine says it's plus one something because of the extra knight but this knight is not really a great power here white cannot win with the checks black king will just move around those squares and there's no possibility to give the check with the knight and the moment white moves the knight then it's gonna be checks from black sides so this is actually a draw and our move is also not a seven so let's get back once again and try to solve this puzzle the other way we have extra knight on the board right so let's try to get this knight into the game and we have here knight c3 obviously we don't want to play knight a3 because this is far away from h pawn it's not really helping us so knight here black pushes the pawn and now we have knight e2 we want to fork with knight g3 so let's say h1 queen we're gonna play knight g3 and this is the fork that i just mentioned um so if black here promotes the knight then what's the point of that we will just push the pawn and we're gonna be uh having a queen next move so at this point after knight e2 this seems like okay we found the solution this is so easy but in fact black can play king to g4 avoid knight g3 to happen and next move is pretty much free move h1 queen and this is really bad position for white and here's a funny line that i'm gonna show you so let's say seven queen we have a queen and as those two queens are fighting the same diagonal we have here e3 beautiful check and white gonna lose the queen on a8 so this is a quite tragic line knight e2 is not the great move so as in the previous puzzle i thought that i'm taking the moves from backwards seems like we have to move with a knight first move and then our second move knight e2 is not that correct so we're taking that back and we're looking for something better so how to stop the pawn the pawn is about to be a queen and there's a smart way how about we capture the pawn this looks silly i know but let's say queen now we have this fork that we were looking for but no one will queen at this position everybody will capture the knight of course and now as the king is located on the diagonal we have this trick a7 queen this is must to play and we also have a queen and we're just winning black's queen just like that so this is the winning line i know it's a bit complicated so let's get back once again at this position and let's see what is the winning line so we go with knight c3 here we have h2 and this is the winning move the best move here and after these moves white is just winning a queen and of course the position as well so this is our solution and i hope you guys solved it with me if not you can use the same technique as i'm using checking out all these moves which are so obvious some kind of check some kind of a fork threads and knight moves and so on and eventually you will find a solution so thank you very much for watching. I'm going to see you next week. Bye bye.